Hi, I'm Mona Dalal and I'm making a pear brie bruschetta. It's basically French crusty bread topped with creamy brie and caramelized pear. It's a very quick and easy recipe and I hope you enjoy it. The first step for bruschetta is we brush crusty bread with some olive oil, put it in the oven which is preheated at 200 degrees and lightly toast it which may take approximately 3 to 4 minutes. We move to our next step that's caramelizing the pear, that's 2 tablespoons of butter and to this we add honey. and we lightly caramelize the pears so it gives a lovely coat to thinly sliced pears be gentle so the pears don't break and they just lightly coat it it becomes a little sticky The pears are now lightly caramelized. If you like a little more sweetness, I would add a little bit more of honey. That's what I enjoy. So we have a pear topping ready, which may take approximately three to four minutes. The thinly sliced pear is beautifully caramelized and we take it out in a bowl and keep it aside. Then we move on to our next step. We've got our lightly toasted bread. To this, you add a slice of your brie cheese and put it back on to your slice of baguette. It's a soft cheese which is available in the market. Cut thin slices of it to use it for this recipe. This goes back into the oven until the brie lightly melts onto your bread which may take approximately three to four minutes. We've got our bread ready with the brie. It's ready to just lightly kind of spread it on your toast. It's a beautiful creamy cheese. And then we top it with our caramelized honey pears. Perfectly glazed pears, which you can put it on your bruschetta. sprinkle some nuts and you're ready to serve it a light sweet snack which I'm sure your guests would enjoy it do try this snack and give us your feedback and I'm sure you would enjoy it download the Tala Dalal app on your Apple and Android devices follow us on the Facebook at taladalal.com if you enjoy our recipes, click like. To see more of my recipes, click here. Please share your comments. I would love to hear them. I'm waiting for them.